Development of a virtual anatomy lab, FanVR, APP, for implementation during the COVID-19 pandemic to ensure 3D learning with scanned cross-sections. VanVR app is changing the way users interact with 3D anatomy content online by providing an integrated and intuitive virtual environment. Background Vancouver Virtual Reality Anatomy and Pathology Project, VanVR, APP, is an application co-constructed by graduate students at the Centre for Digital Media and the Faculty of Medicine in Vancouver, BC, Canada. During the COVID-19 pandemic, we created a customized virtual anatomy lab to allow for experiential, three-dimensional education to proceed while access to the physical lab was restricted. The creation of this lab was successful, and we determined what both the educators and the learners require in a 3D learning platform to make this an intuitive and fluid tool. When restrictions are lifted, the digital twin of the anatomy lab will remain as an additional learning resource for students. This virtual lab will need to offer the value of full curricular integration with a focus on the learning outcomes. Challenges. The creation of 3D content is accelerating and educators are increasingly incorporating 3D assets into their learning ecosystems, but there is no fluid integration yet. Platforms like Sketchfab offer to be a repository of 3D content, but they do not provide subject specific context. This can lead to alienation and disengagement with the content. In some cases, it can be inappropriate to display 3D content outside of a professional and respectful context. Unlike 3D display platforms like Sketchfab, our solution delivers the content in an educational context, designed with a curriculum ingrained in the storytelling of the experience. Benefits FanVR APP provides the students a virtual space to study 3D scanned anatomy specimens within the context of a lab environment. Specimens have labels that are specific to the learning objectives and the scope of the lab session. Rich media such as video content, illustrations, or audio explanations can be uploaded to enhance the student's understanding. VanVR APP was released as an emergency COVID response to allow for continuity of instruction while the physical labs were closed. This allowed students to experience anatomy lab instruction in a 3D virtual space. Conclusion We have developed a full 3D environment for a virtual anatomy lab with over 100 specimens scanned and labeled for use in the app. Hundreds of health professional students at UBC have been using this app since September 2020. Students were able to learn anatomy with the 3D specimens in a virtual lab, which was integrated into a full learning ecosystem that comprised photographs, interactive syllabi, and videos. We are continuing to develop the app to increase the usability and in order to create a digital twin for the physical lab that will be accessible for students anytime, anywhere. Careful curation of the materials, labels, and rich media allows for relevant and focused curricular integration. Future implementations. Improved interface design for students and instructors is the next development step. In addition, we will be exploring more intuitive 3D controls, both for the web interface and full VR implementation. Student responses to the Van VR APP were varied. The 3D brain scans and horizontal and coronal slices were exceptional. These essentially replaced the need for a wet lab, and because I could go and look at them at any time, I think it facilitated my learning more than a wet lab would have. I am sad we missed out on doing labs in person. The technology used in the online lab was incredible, but nothing can do real-life specimens justice. Would have been cool to see the cadavers in real life but I thought the videos and 3D images were super helpful for really seeing structures close up. Development of a virtual anatomy lab, VanVR, APP, for implementation during the COVID-19 pandemic to ensure 3D learning with scanned cross-sections. Pennyfather, Scott, Dunn, Dixit, Dijkstra, Feshtek, Sean, Zhang, Shu, Li, Yan, Chen, Lin, Myers, Krebs, 